welcome back to Styling Saturdays. Today, installment in the series is called The Lovebird's Nest. And it's actually a sew up. And uh, it is quite easy to do, seems very complicated, but is not actually. This is uh, a thread of linen thread onto a knitting needle. Uh, or Kevin Murphy has this very handy sewing kit that you may use. And there's three different bits of uh, thread that you can reuse and reuse if you're actually pretty, pretty good about it. You should be able to just pull out your up style very easily and, and reuse the thread again. So it's one bit of thread, about an arm's length or a little tiny bit more, and attached to a rather large, um, you can either use a knitting needle that would be blunt on the end so there's no daggering, no death, no death by hairdresser. And, uh, or you could use, like this comes in the Kevin Murphy kit, which is really handy. So either way, you can actually use ribbon. So you can actually put a contrast of thread in through your design, or you can do something that matches your hair color somewhat. Um, so honestly, just brush everything back as, as you normally would. You can do a bit of a, um, a uh, ponytail section and do a little twirl so that everything is nice and and uh, tight in there. You can tuck the little tail underneath and now take your, your needle and your thread and pull, pull a little sag like you would do your um, bobby pin and pull that thread all the way through till it's just kind of tucking out and you want to do three of those um, sections with no tension at all and then on your third round again just scooping a little bit of your section and a bit of your base you're going to do a blanket stitch so you pull that guy all the way through and again tuck any of your bad boys and then actually pull it quite tight so if you feel like it's good enough you might be good but just until you run out of thread you can continue to do some sections until you feel as secure as can be and you can see it's lasting it's actually doing a pretty good job of holding itself up if you want your little guys to pop out if fine if not then um, you want to secure them in and just keep on making a couple of rounds you might want to take a little bit of a, of a mirror break so you can actually see what everything is looking like underneath your thread at the end right there and the only thing I'll say is try not to cut your hair and there's your lovebird's nest